Sean Driscoll returned to the football field this season after not going out for the team the previous year. Cornerback number 15, Sean Driscoll. It's a decision Sean has to be happy with after helping the Highlanders earn the state championship. It's feeling like no other. I love, uh, love my school. It shows a lot of school pride. Uh, it shows a lot to our school to win a state championship with all the seniors we had on the team. And all the guys really worked hard for each other and really appreciated each other. Coach Dave Keel learned that Sean was coming back to football when he got a call from his defensive backs coach over the summer. He says, Dave, I've got some good news for you. Sean Driscoll's coming back out for football. I said, really? I said, that is outstanding. He made that decision uh, last year that he really wanted to come back in his senior year and play football, and I endorsed him. We really pushed the guys to play more than one sport. So the success for him in terms of the football team was just outstanding. Great, great learning experience for him. Sean got on the ice as soon as he could once football season ended. The two sports were practicing at the same time during the football team's playoff run. Driscoll would have gone to both football and hockey practice if he could have. If I was allowed to, yes, but I know the football coaches were all over me about not going to hockey, so I just tried to stay out of it as much as I could. Driscoll played offense as a freshman and sophomore, but wanted to earn a spot on defense this season. He did just that and made a major impact, even grabbing this interception, which set up Homestead's second touchdown in the state title game. Well, he's got two pick sixes for touchdowns. He's got like five or six interceptions on here. He's a tough, physical kid. He had a phenomenal season for us, and he hadn't played defense at all, really, until this year. A standout defenseman in hockey, Sean can trigger his team's offense just like he did in football. He's a tremendous skater. He's got a great stride. Um, he's confident with the puck on his stick, so he's good starting the offense. He's just an overall great leader. He's a really good player. He's got an amazing shot. He gets everybody going and tells he improves people and tells people what to do and just an overall great leader and puts a lot of effort on the, on the ice and also off the ice. Aside from football and hockey, Sean excels on the baseball diamond. He helped the Highlanders reach the state summer tournament as a sophomore. He's also an outstanding student. I know last year I had like four AP classes. It was tough, but you know, I like to challenge myself, uh, work hard. Hockey is the one sport in which Sean has not competed at state. The Highlanders are hoping that changes this season, and they're glad to now have their captain on the ice. There's those players that kind of stick out in your mind, and, and Sean is such a smart kid and, again, an amazing athlete, but beyond that, you know, he works really hard in school. Being part of baseball, a baseball team that goes to state, and a football team that wins state, and a hockey team that I'd love to carry on that kind of tradition as those two other sports. Um, he's just pulled in a lot of different directions, but he's always that, that work ethic always is just right there. Hockey is definitely Sean's number one sport. He was drafted by the Des Moines Buccaneers of the USHL, and he could be called up by the team after the high school season. Now here's Colleen Heider from Boston Star to present Sean his award. Sean, for all you do in school and for your sports, Boston Store is proud to present you with the Preps Plus Student Athlete of the Week Award. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah!